Hi, my name is Sarah Lindemann Kamarova. We're here in the Republic of Altai, which is the southernmost part of Russia on the Mongol Chinese border. And this is the village of Majirok, uh, 1,500 people. And when you're talking about rule of law in villages, uh, in most rural areas, uh, the first issue is really about land use, privatization, and uh, about eight years ago, when you see those tall white buildings, they were built illegally. Uh, this is zoned for housing. It's uh, only for people with families. They were built illegally. Uh, the guy thought that he would be able to open a hotel and nobody would mind, but the neighbors did mind. And they contacted the prosecutor's office and after a year, the guy gave up, sold it, and now a very nice family is living in those. More recently, this summer, you can't see it from here, but down there is a favorite place for the villagers to rest and uh, they noticed that an illegal hotel was being built and they collected signatures, 600 signatures. They contacted the prosecutor and actually this is, this is unprecedented. Uh, about, I don't know, a week, two weeks ago they received uh, a letter, the uh, builders of the illegal hotel received a letter that the whole thing had to be torn down, that it was illegal and so it was a victory for the people. And the most recent situation is if you look here where the yellow building is also an illegal, well, they say uh, it's a house, but we know that it's actually also meant to be a little hotel. We've talked to them. They now understand that, uh, that people here care about the zoning laws, and so we're, uh, we're taking a wait-and-see attitude about this. Uh, that's the report from Manjirok, Rule of Law.